the user question I want to make sure to answer it. Someone asked me, how does the body know the difference between when I make you crack as a chiropractor or when you just crack your neck on your own? So the biggest difference between the two is there's not a difference. You see, the noise that winds up occurring is gas within the joints connecting, kind of like when you open a soda bottle. Uh, however, the difference winds up being is that when you wind up going and cracking your neck or cracking your back, the motion that occurs that creates the gas coming together is from segments that are already moving too much and segments that aren't moving enough that are saying do this move, move less and less. When I go in and I feel your spine, I'm looking for the areas where there's not appropriate motion. And that's exactly where we deliver the thrust. So when you wind up doing it, you're causing the area that's not moving enough to move less, and that's why you feel like you need to do it more. When we wind up doing it, we find the area that's not moving appropriately cause motion into that area, and why someone will not feel as though they need to be cracked as much, and they won't crack themselves as much. If you've got more questions, write them down below.